Hi lovelies, Lori here. I'm on a mission. Uh, I'm on a mission discovering sugar. I just uh, watched Amygdala and I will never be the same again. He's definitely my most favorite rapper that I've listened to so far, ever, after that song. I mean, it's mind-blowing, honestly. I cannot understand his thought process after that song. I mean, I can, but still, it's too much. <laughs> it was too much. It's amazing. So yeah, I decided to watch the Chita. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it correctly or not. The Chita. Uh, I'm trying to read the Hangul word, but I suck at Hangul. So, hmm, the Chita. So yeah. Let's see, uh, the Chita, if this is gonna make me cry like amygdala, I will have to take a break. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, the reaction for the Chita starts now. <laughs> You know, the video colors and everything, it's so different. They're so different. Who that location? He has the cut from Amygdala. Do these two songs have something in common? <coughs> Sorry. If you have more information than me, please let me know. I have no idea about anything. I just saw the cut in the last video and I see that he has now too. And the pill popper, you know, he was popping pills in, in Amygdala, so... Hmm. Who's the king? Who's the boss? The agent? The idol? In my hands? The gang gang no man? No bird? They have known it. Oh, is he talking about those guys? Ah. Uh... That we're talking shit at the beginning. Uh, look at the chicken. I love the mixture of the traditional uh, instruments and the rapping. Take a chance, you know, you don't 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 know, you
that was honey for my ears i need to listen to it Okay. <laughs> oh, how many of them are there? I, I thought he killed him. I really thought. Okay. No. No. Can somebody explain this? Oh. I need more information. It's not enough. I don't get it. <laughs> I like it. I like him. Oh, I need I, I, I really need to listen to that part again. Where is it? Oh, that part is amazing. Uh, amazing. He's amazing. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> he is. Oh, yeah, I cannot wait to listen to more of his songs. Yeah. This is more of, I like this type of rap, uh, is the mm, cocky style of rapping, which I really like, uh, you know. But Amygdala, for that one, I cannot, yeah, I don't want to... <laughs> get into it yeah i like them both for different reasons i will be listening to both for different reasons i like this one because it has those catchy sounds you know the uh, traditional instruments uh with the rapping you know new style of rapping with the traditional instruments they go so well together i don't know and him singing just with that little bit of sound on the back you know Oh, him rapping, not singing, sorry. Him rapping with that little bit of sound in the back. It just sounds so good. I mean, yeah, he's good. He's really, really good. Yeah, I love it. I love it. Thank you so much for recommending uh, August Day. I'm really, really loving this journey. 
yeah, I'm I'm a baby army. <laughs> Officially, after this, I'm a baby army. Yeah, I, I don't go into fandoms easy. It took me like half a year of listening to 80s before I became an 18 So, yeah, I felt like cheating on stray kids when I got into 80s um, for some reason. So, yeah, I, I, I did not want to become a fan over another group. So getting into 80s was very difficult for me. I, I am not a fan of any other groups. I know the name of other groups, but I don't know anything about them. I Yeah, I've listened to one of the songs from Seventeen, uh, Hot. That's, I think, the only other song that I've ever listened to from other groups. And that one by mistake. Uh, so I, I get into a fandom very difficult to be honest. And before I can say that I'm a part of that fandom, I take it really seriously for some reason. I don't know. It's just a fandom, I know. But still, for me, it's, it's something important. For me, it's something difficult to accept. <laughs> um, so yeah, I am a baby army now. Oof, that feels so awkward to say. Because I've always been like, you know, having beef with ARMY uh, when uh, voting for Stray Kids because, you know, I'm a full time stay. So, yeah, now I'm going to have a very difficult problem uh, when voting. It's going to definitely come to the song <laughs> choices <laughs> when voting because that's going to be difficult. Yeah. Uh, with 80s I, I, and Stray Kids, I don't have to worry because unfortunately 80s are not that popular yet. So they don't even come close to, you know, having that many votes. So I don't have to, to deal with that. Even if I vote for 80s, it's still not going to do anything, <laughs> honestly. But uh, it's always between Stray Kids and BTS. But now it's going to be very difficult for me to to decide i'm still leaning towards stray kids because i know them more but after hearing august if oh uh, no i'm not gonna say anything i'm gonna put myself on fire uh yeah so i'll uh, see you again um with more august the uh Yungi marry me songs he's a serious songwriter and rapper and I like him a lot. I like his style. It's definitely what I, I want from a rapper. Thank you so much for spending time with me. Uh, see you again lovelies. Uh, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and uh, see you again soon. Bye!